All right, guys, um, welcome to Cocktail Cures, brought to you by 81 The Prom. I'm Raj, I'm your bartender. Um, let's, uh, let's drink, shall we? Um, this episode, we have the Remember, Remember shot, um, a bonfire night themed beverage, uh, brought to you by 81, because we like making up drinks as we go along. It's more fun that way. So um, yeah, it's, uh, it's a great little uh, drink, especially for parties and everything, if you've got the right, uh, Right ingredients, very, very easy to get a hold of. Um, let's do it. Okay, here we have the Remember Remember shot. Uh, another one of these conceptual drinks that I love so much. And uh, we start off with a bit of grenadine. Which is always quite handy, because it's layered. And grenadine's nice and, uh, nice and heavy. And there we go. Because there was lots of blood spilled. More by the hangings than anything, but oh well. Um, there we go. Uh, we follow that up with a bit of creme de menthe. Follow it up with creme de menthe because the Pope drinks creme de menthe, apparently. And um, Guy Fawkes himself was Catholic, so you know we thought we'd use that nice vague connection to uh, to accommodate this drink. That boom, there we go. A little layer of creme de menthe. And when we've done that, we follow it up with a reference to jolly old England. London, in fact, what with it being the, uh, the Houses of Parliament that were uh, attacked, with a bit of Bombay Sapphire dry, uh, London Dry Gin. Fantastic, that uh, sits just on top of the grenadine, uh, not the grenadine, well, the grenadine and the crème de man. And when we've done that, um, we add it with, uh, we add to it um, absinthe because Fawkes himself uh, spoke French, fought in France, and did all that, uh, all that jazz during the 80 Years' War, I believe. So boom, there we go. A little layer of absinthe. Oh yes. And as has been the theme with most of these bonfire night drinks, it's on fire. Where on earth is my lighter? There it is. Okay, brilliant. So once again, boom. Oh, oh, is it gonna work? Wait. Ah! Light, you devil. There we go. Let it burn for a minute. Remember, remember. Or, oh. or oh, don't if you have too many of those. Um, brilliant. The remember, remember shop. Okay, and uh, that was the Remember Remember shot. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did, um, despite the grimace on my face as I did it. Um, yes, if you liked the episode, hit the subscribe button. Um, there's links in the description box below to our Facebook and Twitter. Give us a go on those, hit the like button, because you know you love us. If you've got any ideas for cocktails that you'd like us to come up with recipes for, bang them in the comment section below. Uh, or if you've just got anything nice to say about the show, we can't do that. No abuse, I don't want to hear it. I'm a nice person. I'm sensitive. Um, okay, uh, we've got a good array of drinks coming up in the next uh, next few episodes as, uh, as well. I'll, um, oh, I can't think actually what we got um, coming up next. Go on, go on, producer. Go, go, check. Uh, hot chocolate. We've got some hot chocolate-based drinks. We've got the Chococello, another one of our 81 creation. Uh, and, oh, we've, we've actually decided to do a mocktail because there's some non-drinkers out there, apparently, who've been pestering us about that. And, uh, and we're going to start doing the, um, the audience-based drinks as well, the, uh, the, the ideas that you've given us. Fantastic. So, um, yeah, this was Cocktail Cures, and uh, look forward to seeing you next time.